Hello people, this is George with yet another Call of Dragons video. Today we will continue this series regarding Warpets. Uh, last one was about uh, Sapphire Fire Drake and you can check the Sapphire Fire Drake guide and today it will be about Berserk Fire Drake. Well, uh, at first, as always, we will be speaking about uh, attributes, which attributes will be good uh, to get on a S tier or even A tier, and which one does not matter. Well, uh, Berserk Frederick is a unique pet, in my opinion, because uh, as my experience says, you can play it with a two style. One style, uh, which is one of the most popular one, which have been said by a lot of people, is with Arrogance. And uh, this pet will be for the Forondil new hero, which will come out, the Cavalry hero. Where uh, Arrogance, the main deal about Arrogance is that this pet will do a lot of stacks, uh, marks, which Forondil does too. And whenever there is a more stacks, you will deal more damage. And that's a synergy between foreign deal and the arrogance. Uh, regarding other uh, attributes uh, for the uh, Berserk Frederick, well, in terms of the arrogance, as you can see, determined by intelligence and warped skill physical. Maybe it's a bug, maybe it's not. But if it's uh, it's a bug, then of course it, uh, strengths uh, will be good uh, because it's a physical. Uh, if not, intelligence will be. Uh, like at, at least on A tier uh, will be good for the Berserk Frederick. Regarding other spells, uh, well, the Arrogance is a main spell and also it attacks the uh, range is near and it will be good for the uh, Eagles. You can upgrade this passive skill to Terrible Arrogance, which will give you additional stacks of the uh, Arrogance, so uh, it will be like. Uh, best synergy for the foreign deal uh, with this war pet because it's, it has a lot of synergies between the skills and between the foreign deal's uh, skill set. Uh, other skills, well, you can choose like just physical damage, uh, like you can go for crit, but in my opinion, uh, first and main choice is always like terrible arrogance to upgrade your main skill and after that, it's just adding, like you're just adding more stats and more skills uh, with the better uh, fighting skills uh, as you prefer. Uh, well, as as we already said, if this is intelligence, you will be going for an intelligence-based uh, attributes. It will be better. If not, just physical and like strength and agility is always good. Well, I just found out by myself that there is another way of playing Berserk Frederick, which in my opinion is better. Uh, uh, for the base stats, for the second style of the Berserk Frederick will be strength, agility and luck. Uh, I have a good strength agility here, but low luck. It will be better if I will have a good luck too. So what's the point of this style uh, of Berserk Frederick? First of all, this one was for Ondil, and in my opinion, this one is for Emrys. It has an amazing synergy between Emrys and Bakshi, uh, in my opinion, and right now I will tell you why. Let's go through the skills which I have chosen to have. Uh, first one is like 40% to deal damage target when your deputy casts a rage skill. So it's important to have a, a deputy hero which is casting spells, casting skills more often, right? And it's called Fierce Attack. Second skill is like a super fierce attack, like better version of the first skill, and it, it, it has a higher chance to get triggered. And also there is like another way, like passive skill, which will uh, add even more chance to even more damage dealt by the first attack so these all three skills are in a synergy and every each of them like this is a determined by strengths uh, this is uh, determined by luck and this is determined by agility and what's the synergy about uh, we need heroes which are uh, generating as much rage as possible in order for us to benefit from these three skills every each of them has a synergy by having a uh, heroes which are have, which are doing uh, rage generation. 
uh, we will go to the heroes right now we will go to the emery's and you can see here rage accumulation, like accumulation speed bonus it's amazing and we can go to the bakshi and bakshi has a rage accumulation speed bonus so in my opinion uh, the second style is much much better it has a much much better synergy uh, for the following uh, things, like you can just add pure stats, like even Maniac Knight would be great uh, for the shield, like uh, shield penetration. This can be good. There is couple of art, couple of skills which is giving uh, March speed. Um, I don't remember the name, and that will be good too. But basically, I think you understand. Everybody understands what I, I just said. These skills have synergy by having a a uh, lot of rage and Emery and Bakshi are like one of the most uh, like they are good because they are accumulating rage really really fast. Uh, that's the second style which I prefer, and the first style is like for on deal and with these marks. Uh, th that's the guide. That's what I wanted to share. Like I just found out about this uh, new style, and I wanted to share. If you like the video, press like or comment or share your your own idea. This is a big game. Everybody has their own ideas and their own way of playing. And we all will benefit if we will share our, our good ideas and we will learn this game better and better. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.